No. That was an under spin. Let's try again. Over spin. These little beasties are like teachers. They don't allow you to do a one little mistake. Yeah. The reason why instinctive throwers should have at least one set of light traditional bow shurikens is that it gives you different training stimulus. It increases your, it deepens your understanding of how to control any point you object. Really, there is no boundaries to what you can throw. Here we have tiny needle. This is the most hardcore thing you can know spin, but everything's possible. Check out the link from the description. There we have. Jonas Mandikowski throwing this from 5 meters, no spin style. Here I got another traditional bow shuriken called Sinjestu Ryu. The length is 19 centimeters, round shape, steel is high carbon and the finish is nice and smooth. It doesn't really matter, is it round shape, square, hexagon, is it six millimeters, five, eight, whatever, do you have a knife, a nail, an axe, a boosterican, every pointy object obeys the throw that is done correctly. Grip from the bottom. It is very important to keep the grip closed at all times and do not actively slide or push with your index finger the object should leave from your grip by itself. The object is thrown to the target by the hips. Boom! Boom! Everything else happens. Throwing arm is all the way throughout the throw relaxed. No need to lean forward. Active muscle work in this area. Passive muscle work in this area. Back loop is very important. It makes the object to fly straight. At the peak of the back loop, the tip of the object should point backwards from the target. Then you shoot with your hips and the arm just follows along like a whip. Lastly, the flicking wrist. That is the culmination of power. That is the tip of the whip. Boom! Boom! That happens very fast. By itself, the throwing arm is not totally passive, it's not totally loose. Otherwise, it would look like this. It must be directed, guided. So, Straight line. Straight line. By straight line, I mean that you should throw along a tube that goes from your hand to the bullseye. And in the end, tip of the object should point to the target. Here we have 14 centimeters MSR shuriken. No spin from longer distances is exactly the same as from closer distances. You just have to trust the technique. Oftentimes we tend to lean forward and use active throwing arm muscle work, but that's a mistake. Half spins are thrown in the same way that no spins. There is only one little difference. The grip has to be looser so that there is less traction upon the release. This way the object can rotate more. This little 
shurikens are made for health spin. The tip is very sharp and very durable. Check it out. Even if I throw it with the hard wood, the tip doesn't bend. It's amazing. Nothing. If I would have to pick one shuriken out of these three, it would be the octagon pan because this is the heaviest and that makes it easy to throw. But these are also very nice shurikens and a lot easier to throw than these short ones.